Hey guys, it's Ren, and today's Tuesday, which means new story quest. And the first story quest is going to be Strange Readings, Dismantle 3 Arcane Barometers. You can find them at the location of the Aegis Towers. Now, once you get to one of the Aegis Towers, you're going to find them. They're going to be glowing and lit up, so you'll be able to find them pretty easy. There's three per tower, so you should be able to get it done. And in the case that you don't get all three done in one tower, you can do it in separate games. Or you can just visit us another tower and get it done if there's still some left there. Now, the next is going to be the Phenomenon, which is visit all five Aegis Towers. Now, here's where all five Aegis Towers are again. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to either land somewhere else or land right here where the stairs are on the Aegis Tower and the glowing circle. Now, make sure you let the thing count down all the way. I had an issue where I couldn't get it done in multiple matches, so maybe this is one that you have to do in one match. And if that is the case, here's the pathing I took to get mine done, and maybe it'll help you out. You can make your own path or do whatever, but this is the one I took that helped me get it done. So, maybe that'll help you get it done as well. Now, the last one, Power of the Aegis, Sustain the Aegis Tower Power for 30 seconds, is going to be the reason why the Aegis Towers are going to be more populated than normal you're gonna find people competing over it. and if someone gets it before you they're gonna get it so I'd recommend just landing and spamming E as soon as possible and trying to get it if you're gonna try to compete with somebody for it you do have to get this one first so if you miss out or someone else gets it you're not gonna be able to get the tower power from this location you're gonna have to visit another tower now all you have to do once you finally do get it is just stay alive for 30 seconds don't get exiled, and even if you do get into a fight, it should be pretty easy to survive for 30 seconds because you do get an extra 100 shield and 100 white health just by getting the tower power. So I hope that helps somebody out, and hopefully you can get this done, and it's not too much of a challenge for you. And I will hope to see you next time.